Hey everyone, welcome to the channel, it's uh, Rad from Radko Tarot and uh, in this whole video we're going to look into Libra Sun Moon and also uh, Libra Rising Weekly General Tarot Reading not January but February 7th up until February 13th uh, 2022 and uh, should you wish to skip the draw and go right away for uh, the reading you can totally do that by using the timestamp in the description down below other than this if you do enjoy uh the content here on the channel and you do wish to support us just leave a like guys subscribe hit the notification bell so you do not miss any of our weekly uploads nor our live streams uh, as well so uh that being said let's do the draw the first card that you do have libra that is going to be the six of uh, swords uh followed by the second card which stands as uh, the devil moving next we do have uh the knight of swords followed by uh the two of cups and uh, the final card for you that is going to be uh the four of cups but i do also want to draw one more card here for the knight of swords and the card is going to be ooh, two of swords all right so that's uh, going to conclude it for the draw and now let's jump right away into the spread itself all right libra so you can see your spread on the screen here and uh my that is gonna be very very strong uh week uh where do i even begin from so uh here we do have a potential just oh my god uh here we do have a potential romantic interest okay here at the very start of the week we do have a very very strong breakthrough and on top of it at the end it seems that not just only you are going to find yourself pretty pleased of how the week went through but the opportunity seems that they just doesn't end okay so uh, uh let, let's focus for now at the start of the week now six of swords follow up with the devil the only two ways how these cards could manifest are at least of right off the top of my head is that one of them it's either you will have an, an amazing opening it's it, you you can't even say it's that it is an opportunity it is like a such a flawless arrangement of the circumstances for you to uh put to, to set your foot on a ground that you wanted to be at but you didn't have the chance by now on a ground of new job or on a ground of a promotion and that may be through you have to substitute somebody before your boss sees that you are better than the subs than the uh uh, how do you call it um the person who is primarily doing the job and they decide well you know i will have you instead of them but uh, the other one uh, the other version is that you are to grow balls and actually stand for yourself and make your personal demands and make your action make the actions required for you to make a change for you to make a difference the result alas is going to be more or less the same and the result is that by the middle of the week, Libra, you are going to find yourself in a place where whatever you say goes. I mean, it's it's a place where you get to control the circumstances. You get to force the circumstances you want to, to take place so you can fulfill the yearnings, whatever yearnings you do have. The devil it is like... Um, Okay, let's talk a little bit about the devil because uh, unexperienced readers are taking that card as a very negative one and impulsive. And, and I'm going to talk a little bit about religion here just as far as the devil is concerned. Uh, the devil is... Uh, it does represent the devil itself, but the devil itself does not fall from heaven because they hate us the devil fall, fell from hell because at least according to the card itself um lore of the card itself uh, when god made us they asked the the, the 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 devil which was lucifer at that point 
to bow, to bow before us, to kneel and to love us more than he loves God. And he, he refuses because he can't love us more than he loves God. And uh, that broke out the internal conflict, you know, and eventually Lucifer was defeated and he was banished to hell. And he, why I'm saying that is because he, his purpose is not to harm us. Why would he harm us? He is going to just make us martyrs, being worthy for the uh, uh, for, for for heaven. the 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 purpose of of the devil is to make us unworthy for heaven. And for that reason, the devil comes to us as everything we have ever wanted. So we take advantage of it. So we abuse it. You know, so we fall to greed, corruption, so on and so forth. So the devil gives us the means. How we use that means, uh, it's it's a different way of, um, uh, it's it makes a difference, I'm sorry. And so while through the Six of Swords, where we now have the courage, either we have the courage or the circumstances right to set foot in a place we yearn for, that gives us the power to dictate the circumstances at the devil, okay? How we are going to di dictate those circumstances depends entirely on us. If we become rigid, if we become tyrannical, obviously that's not good. But if we do use our influence and our power to make good and to, to heal, for example, or to make people happy, then we are going to do a pretty, pretty good job. And that's why your start of the week, Libra, it's a very, very strong because whatever you lacked of, whatever hungers you had, whether you you are hungry for love or or for money or for work you know or just for happiness you will have the predispositions and the incentives to make that happen how you're going to make it happen that is within your hands that falls to your choice and the only condition of the devil card is by you making your choice that way you do not mess around with the lives of others okay you do not make decisions for others and you do not damage their how can i put it into words their lives in general and uh sitting on that place of power because it's truly it's a place of power that individual shows up here which is the knight of swords with uh the two of so with the two of swords these are a uh, active supporters and that person finds themselves a very fond of you in fact that individual was looking for a character just as you are powerful determined being able to dictate their own rules and so on and so forth and now they are to make the conscious decision to make a contact in one or another way now knight of swords these people they are very intellectually agile and they are very um, analytical and also very determined headstrong however whenever they do make a decision to either chase a job or to chase somebody in this particular case you that decision although logical because the logic behind it here is that they seek for a person of your character and they finally found you okay uh that decision is also consulted with their emotions meaning that they do not do it out of just because that is how their criteria are dictating because they truly want to they they feel um a touch they do have a, an emotional content into the situation and the follow-up is two of cups and as a general reading we cannot definitely say that that is the love of your life but definitely the potential it's right there i mean it's the two of cups but the two of cups generally kind of speaks for a very strong solid we can't even call it a partnership it's it's unity and within this unity and partnership or a, a romance that is going to um embark in between you two we see no shyness we see no pride we see no no games uh, in general <clears throat> that person depending on where it's going to show up for you has the uh the affinity to make your work 
be very pleasant, to make your uh, social circle uh, or social life being also very pleasant, to make your romantic life being very pleasant. And at that point, when you approach the end of the week, Libra, you are going to be pretty full, okay? Uh, full in a sense of that you wouldn't be able to think of anything more you would want to at that given stage, giving your personal limitations, giving your uh, how far your limit stretches, because with the Six of Swords, you will be very, at the start of the week, you are going to be very um, objective about how far you actually can stretch your hands and what opportunities you can handle and what you cannot handle all right but um because things are going to go very well up until the end of the week at the end of the week you are to sit uh, full it's like what else one can want from life right but that is going to be a very wrong standpoint now the four of cups it does speaks that you are going to be there the end of the week enjoying the fruits of your accomplishments and your achievements enjoying the love that you may create in between you and the knights of uh, swords enjoying the business that you may establish enjoying your power as well to dictate and to call the shots into your career or into your social life and what of it right and so with the four of cups there are there there is at least one opportunity that is lingering around you but because you are going to be full with the fruits of your labor at that point you may miss it if you do address your accomplishments emotionally instead at the end of the week you need to be opportunist in a sense of that um i don't know how to put it into words so i'm going to say it that way uh instead of feeding yourself up with the same fruits of your labor, you have to become picky and seek for more. Uh, because uh, those uh, those accomplishments, they're going to fade with time and you need something more to keep you up. And that is pretty much uh, your uh, your reading for the week. It's, it's a great week. I mean, towards the middle of it, it seems that you are going to feel like on the top of the world giving your current situation because some people will feel more than the other than the others okay for some people just a, a, a tiny improvement and speaks uh, is gonna make them feel on the top of the world uh but yeah it's uh it's a great week i do hope that you use those uh power over circumstances in a really good way to do good rather than the opposite and uh, at the end of the week, you will still be hungry for accomplishments because the opportunities are going to be there. It all falls to you to capitalize on them. So that being said, Libra, this was your weekly general tarot reading, guys. Hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it. And we are to see each other next time. Until then, bye.